just fine. When I met Chris Hazel, man, I was blacked out on heroin. Yeah, like, I'm just kidding. Nintendo was playing in the background, and I thought I was playing it, but my back was to it. What it means to be an independent artist to me is. You know, just freedom. I mean, you could just freedom of expression. You can do anything that you want with your art, and you know, you can play a two-minute song, and you don't have to fall into the contemporary standard written pop song, where you gotta write a four-minute, three-minute jam or something. And I feel like you can really spread things out different ways. You can play your guitar a certain way, and people don't uh, don't judge you on it. You play the drums a certain way. And, you if we like the way it sounds, we play it that way. Yeah, we play Instead it that way. Instead of having our way. producer <laughs> shoving his fist in our face and saying, Well, I know it. First time I picked up my first instrument, I was probably like six years old. It was a piano. I didn't actually pick it up, but yeah. That's uh, it's pretty heavy. <laughs> Just kind of moved along through different instruments and found the bass guitar was my favorite one. So it's very odd. I never had any interest in drums until my friend was like, "You should probably just try it out." And I was like, "Oh wait, this is awesome! <laughs> like, oh, I love this." Uh, music's always music's always been in my family, and like uh, you know, my whole family they all played sports and played guitar. So but my first instrument was the bass. I picked up the bass first, and it's because all my older cousins and my older family members were allowed to play guitar. So I picked up the bass, and I was about 12 years old, and that was, that was my first instrument. I'm the most recent member of the band. I joined a little over a year ago. Jared contacted me saying, we are getting ready to go on this month and a half long cross country tour and our drummer can't do it. Could you fill in? When I would write the songs, I would just write them, take them to the band, and we, Aaron and our other drummer would figure it out. Um, when we added Adam, you know, we had never played together and I just started playing this just like guitar riff. I didn't really write the song. It wasn't finished, it wasn't complete. I just started playing it and then Adam just <laughs> and it just like fell together, then Aaron plugged in his bass as fast as he could and then it all sank in together. And then, you know, that's kind of been what we do now. I, they just, the words come out almost like a un, uh, like word vomit. They just kind of fall out of my mouth and on paper and then when it's all said and done, then I can look back and it's kind of just about, some of the songs are about not wanting to grow old. We wrote a song called Bruja that sounds like we're talking about a witch, but when I finished, when I finished writing it, I was like, that song's about beer, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's like, that song's about beer. I write a lot about like the past, you know, and then the future. Never, I guess I don't really, really ever write about the now, I guess, and that's whatever I've been through in my life. People that come and go and how uh, everything kind of fades into itself in the end. I came in kind of, I've always been a heavy metal drummer, and so coming in and playing with these guys, like, really, there's some cool stuff you can do with it, and it's a very interesting, like, kind of mix between this, like, kind of lighter indie rock sort of stuff, but, like, this, ins you know, really as insane as you can get a kind of ri rhythm section, yeah. Yeah. It's very cool, but, yeah. <laughs> I, I measure success by how I feel after, like how I feel just playing the music. Like if it's the vibe is right, in that moment when we were playing on stage and when we were playing in rehearsal, I, that's successful to me. I mean, it's not about money for me, it's just about meeting people like you guys and you know, meeting people yeah. like uh, anyone and just putting on good shows and then just know that we have a short time doing it and might as well do it our way, you know.